Imagine this, an organization entirely dedicated to preserving what you see, an organization devoted to encouraging and educating everyone from elementary age students to the elderly on being knowledgeable stewards of the environment, improving litter prevention methods and promoting recycling, reducing waste and its costly disposal. Does one exist? Yes. Who are we? We are the nonprofit organization Keep Cock County Beautiful, the local chapter of Keep Tennessee Beautiful on the state level and Keep America Beautiful. Why are we here? To preserve the community and improve the quality of life by promoting a cleaner, healthier, safer environment for Newport and Cock County. How do we get to our current status of nine years being an affiliate in good standing as part of the President's Circle? Let's listen to Betty Carver associated with this effort from its inception. Betty? In September of 1998, Keep Cock County Beautiful Incorporated became the name of it, the organization. In December of 2006, Keep America Beautiful presented the William Nash Award to Keep Cock County Beautiful, saying it had fully embraced the Keep America Beautiful mission and incorporated it in the daily lives of the citizen it serves. April 2010, the fourth and current executive director, Tim Burkle, was hired. Many programs that were started in 2004 continue today with new programs that have been researched, planned, and implemented. KCCB promotes the three R's, reduce, reuse, recycle. The purpose of Keep Cock County Beautiful is to promote a cleaner and healthier environment for Newport and Cock County and to protect our precious natural resources. We accomplished our three major goals just referenced of litter prevention, recycling, and beautification through our board of directors and citizens working directly with elected and appointed local officials. Hear what they have to say. I'm Connie Ball, uh, Mayor of Newport, Tennessee. Uh, pleasure to be here today to talk about uh, uh, all the good things that uh, Keep Cop County Beautiful and Red does for our community. Uh, I know in several conversations uh, that I've had throughout the city and the community that uh, our citizens are very pleased with the efforts, uh, especially with the uh, education that uh, Tim Burkle and David Veridal are providing our community, uh, especially in our schools, uh, working with the kids, trying to train them, uh, to train their parents, relatives, and friends uh, how important it is uh, to keep our community clean and free of trash and and also uh, the recycle program is extremely critical uh, in that it done properly uh, can definitely save uh, our community uh, tax dollars. The main thing we can do as citizens is report uh, someone throwing trash out or uh, starting an illegal dump site. Hi, I'm Sheriff Armando Fontes, Sheriff of Cock County. Here in Cock County we have 420 square miles of a beautiful countryside that people come to visit and spend time out in our area because of the wonderful nature and the streams and creeks that we have to offer that people can enjoy in sports and activities such as fishing, hiking, and many other things. Here in our area, it's very important that we as a department work with Keep Cock County Beautiful, also with RID, removing illegal dump sites. As sheriff of this community, I believe that it's very important for us to have education, that we go into our school systems teaching our kids to be more conscientious about uh, litter prevention, about recycling, and about being a good steward of the environment that God has given us. We also believe that it's important that we enforce uh, criminal behavior when individuals go out into our community and throw trash out on the roadways. Inmate labor is used by our department uh, in order for us to take and to clean up uh, areas of our community that saves taxpayers money. Uh, we also have litter crews that go out and work closely with Keep Cock County Beautiful and we also have uh, uh, officers that volunteer time to uh, go out into the community to perform community projects using inmate labor. As uh, citizens of Cock County, motivate and encourage one another to be good stewards of this community. I can't thank uh, Keep Cock County Beautiful enough and our RID committees, uh, removing illegal dump sites, all of our volunteers, 
and I can't thank uh, all of the individuals that have made a difference in keeping Pecan County beautiful so that all of us can enjoy the wonderful resources that we have here in our area. Hello, I'm Ray Schultz, Chief of Police for the City of Newport. We're honored to be able to support Keep Cock County Beautiful. As a native of Cock County, I've seen the many changes they've brought forth. We're thankful for our beautified park downtown and all the many things they've done to help keep this Cock County community beautiful. We truly appreciate their efforts. We're so thankful that when visitors come to Newport and Cock County, we don't have a litter problem. We have a litter problem that's being addressed. And we thank Keep Cock County Beautiful very much for addressing our problem. Hi folks, I'm Linda Lewanski, uh, Tourism Director for the Cock County Partnership. And I'm here to encourage you to be good stewards of the environment. We want to keep this beautiful place for our children and our grandchildren and all of our visitors. And then also to take pride, personal responsibility in your designated environment. You know, about a million people come through our roads and our trails to go visit the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. And no matter what a wonderful venue we have, if they see trash and litter, they're probably not going to come back. So please keep it clean. The mayor's office is fully supportive of the mission of both Keep Cock County Beautiful and the efforts of RED. We work with Keep Cock County Beautiful where we can to support the state and or federal grants that, if awarded, will allow us to see reductions in the cost of services we provide to our citizens rather than increases in the fees to dispose of waste. Education about recycling is a process that must take place through the schools, through community groups, all media outlets, and during social activities. We feel that through consistent efforts in educating our citizens, great strides will continue to take place in the areas of litter prevention, recycling, and protecting the natural beauty of Cock County. We are so fortunate to live here. Why is this important to you? Everyone has a stake in this collective purpose. To provide an environment we leave for our children better than the one we inherited. To encourage tourism, businesses, and future residents in an effort to make more of a positive economic impact. To recognize the value of the quality of life we experience. To reduce the collective cost of waste disposal that we and future generations will face. We've had successes with a comprehensive roadside litter campaign, recycling through convenience centers and improving their handling efficiency, removing illegal dump sites, and implementing beautification projects have added value to our county. They've created an environment in which all of the events, trade fairs, and sports activities are litter-free events with on-site recycling. But much more needs to be done. We are surrounded by natural beauty in this county, and our mission at Keep Cock County Beautiful is to preserve these gifts and enhance this county to benefit current and future residents, business and potential employers, tourists, and visitors. We have a special obligation to do so as a gateway to the Great Smoky Mountains. We participate in the TDOT Litter Grant Program utilizing inmate labor in cooperation with the Sheriff's Department to pick up roadside litter on more than 700 miles of roadways in Cock County. If we keep the roadsides free of litter, we are hopeful this will encourage continued litter-free behavior. We have been fortunate in being awarded grants from UPS, Lowe's, Solo Cup, Troy Built, private industry participants, and corporate sponsors for Keep America Beautiful. This has allowed beautification projects such as the Courthouse Annex, replacing uprooted trees at the high school from a tornado, improving the street appeal of our convenience centers, and providing a community space and pavilion at our downtown Memorial Park. Education takes place on all levels for our citizens and visitors alike, as evidenced by the presence of Keep Cock County Beautiful at almost all events and festivals. We strive to make all of these, as well as sporting events, litter-free and recycle events by providing appropriate bin setups and litter collection. We have an education coordinator that interfaces with elementary school children throughout the year to bring home the importance of litter prevention and recycling. These junior citizens are tomorrow's leaders and can provide the example in their homes now and guidance in the future to always be good stewards of our environment and the God-given gifts of our beautiful and bountiful countryside. We are Keep Cock County Beautiful. For more information, visit keepcockcountybeautiful.com.